Good morning, St. Pius. I'm Michael Morgan. And I'm Marcus Merriman. And you're watching The X Factor. Today we are on a Wednesday block schedule. Today's saint of the day is St. Paul the Hermit. St. Paul was reportedly born in Egypt, where he was orphaned by the age of 15. He was also a learned and devout young man. During the persecution of Decius in Egypt in the year 250, Paul was forced to hide in the home of a friend. Fearing a brother-in-law would betray, he fled in a cave in, his, in the desert. His plan was to return once the persecution ended, but of the sweetness of solitude and heavenly Contemplation convinced him to stay. Good job. Yeah. Okay. Come on, Mr. Mike. Murphy needs an A plus student immediately for math tutoring outside of school. <clears throat> Junior boys interested in boys state. A very good leadership opportunity. Safe. Deadline is in one week. The last day to add or drop classes for the semester is today. So do that, please. <laughs> Please talk to Mr. Murphy or Mr. Lee if you have any questions. The St. Pius Chess Club welcomes all students, so if you do not know how to play our royal game and would like to learn or just fine tune your skills, please join the club. The goal of each club meeting is to have fun while learning chess. The Chess Club meets Thursdays, January 30th through March 26th, 2.45 to 3.30 p.m. See Mr. Jerkums for more information. That's fun. Uh, this Friday, the National Honor Society is having a fundraiser, Red Friday, Jeans Day. The proceeds will benefit Operation Breakthrough, which is a child wellness and daycare center, as well as after-school community center. Cost is $5 in the armory, and there is a fun new feature. You can Venmo Mr. Lee in this weird school. She said that like, yep. okay. You can Venmo at SBX Tribe and pay that way as well. You should also do this in the armory if you have cash, so. Today's segment is Wacky Wednesday. Good morning, St. Pius. I'm Wild Woody West. And I'm Bacon Mama 10. And you're watching Wacky, Wacky Wednesday. Wednesday. <coughs> Our first wacky fact of the day is Joe Epperson was born with an extra tooth. Interesting. <laughs> this is a wacky fact. Namdi's dad owns a hotel in Nigeria. That's crazy. <laughs> All right, this is probably the wackiest fact we have today. Carl Ragusa is allergic to peanuts and dogs Lizard. sounds like a horrible <laughs> life this one this might be my favorite wacky fact ella tony hess your mom wow. got married in ireland and is married to a pro rugby player pat hess wow shout out dad our last wacky fact of today is we're going to show you a demonstration of the fact elizabeth witherow can do this, this. weird thing with her <laughs> eyes all right, well, that's all we got for you today. We'll see you next Wednesday. That was wacky. That was crazy. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Today's uh, story of the day is ping pong clip. Hi, I'm Marcus Merriman. And this week's story is on ping pong club. Why did you want to start a ping pong club at St. Pius X? So, you could do something after school if you have nothing to do, you know? Just go around and play some ping pong. Okay, and when does, Jokums. why is it important to have a ping pong club at St. Pius? It helps students uh, free their brain from all the work they do during the day, and it's just an hour that you just have fun after school, and I think uh, most of us, like, we all enjoy it, so it's really fun. So get together and meet new people. It's the uh, second year we've had, uh, or uh, third year we've had the ping pong club there, and right now it's a great, you know, it gives us something to do. After school, if they're not doing basketball or swimming or wrestling, and these are our doubles champions from last year. Okay, so what do we think is going to be the outlook this year? Another win this year? I hope so. Yeah, I hope so. I hope so. Okay. 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 <laughs> I think we have a good yeah. chance in doubles. Hopefully, I win singles. Then. Nah, you're not. Gonna Johnny won singles last year. When does the ping pong club meet? Uh, every Tuesday and Thursday after school, but not during finals week or during the break. All right, this has been this week's story on Ping Pong Club. Now back to you! Club.
Don't you yeah. love learning about ping pong? Yeah, ping pong is amazing. Very interesting <laughs> game. Sports for today is varsity boys basketball at Benton Invitational. Don't know what time. Girls <laughs> swim at Winnetonka in North Kansas City at 4 p.m. Freshman boys basketball at Richmond at 6. Today's lunch is taco salad. Happy birthday today to Kaisa Holum and Nick Voss. So happy birthday. Yeah. I don't. Well, sadly, that is all the announcements we have for today. But that's okay because we will see you tomorrow. Catch you on the flip side. Peace.